Looking well. Let's try this out. Darling! You ever play this before, friend? I said, darling, can I get another bloody drink over here? Oh, come on, chop, chop. Darling, I'm dying of thirst. Is there room, this is meant to be a saloon, not a bloody vicarage. Oh, what's wrong with you? What a girl have to do to get drunk around here? <sighs> Some people are trying to enjoy the drinks, million. I'd enjoy one if someone would fill my bloody glass. Have you seen the new dress shop in town? All direct from Paris, I'm told. No. Madam. <laughs> nice to see you again, cowboy. And you, Miss, um... Lillian Powell. I used to be quite well known. Now I'm just the bloody town drunk. Well, who knew you? The worst types, darling. Intellectuals. In other words, men without balls. Hermaphrodites, as my mother would call them. Eunuchs, as my father liked to say. Geldings. I was popular with geldings, darling. Now even the ballers hate me. I'm a fat old mess. I hear that young railroad man has a girl in every town from here. Back off a bit, darling. This isn't a square dance. Bonjour. Oh, what do you have? There you go. I apologize for the noise, sir. She's uh, had one too many. Yeah, remember when the love of a good woman. I give up booze and opium and that little toy I had sent from Paris. Oh, don't be shocked. None of you, not even you, Tom. Oh, do any of you know about Tom? <laughs> he was a priest. <laughs> Where is bloody Tom? Tom! How do Where you the do? phases are you? Little Catamite was a priest until he got defrocked. <laughs> it was an Bonjour. outrage. He'll tell you all about it. <sighs> Everyone's a liar at this table. That's no lie. Yeah. Tom? Tommy! Hmm. Oh, forgive me, Tom. I'm sorry I called you a catamite. I know it's not true, darling. <sighs> Tom. Tommy! Tom, forgive old Lillian. I'm such a bad boy. I really am. Oh, Tom. He's sulking with me again. I think someone's pissed in his porridge. <laughs> That's what my nanny used to say. Silly old scotch hag smelled of old fish. Thank God she's dead. Can I get another bloody drink? I'm parched. The things are sent to try us. How do you do? Life is very hard. Certainly. I must stop working quite so much and learn to relax. I'm quite withered by stress. Not the first time that's happened, unfortunately. Yeah. Renee's sticking up with another house girl. Silly old fool. Huh. Hmm. I need a bloody drink. Well, well. Somebody get me a drink. Tom! Salut, mon mignon. Would you like me to join you? Mm. Raise. You know, 
They are talking about the legalization of vice and iniquity here. As if the moral turpitude of Saint-Denis needed any further encouragement. Right. Sure. Cet endroit est vraiment devenu méconnaissable. Bon, bon, bon. Unless you miraculously turn into a willowy brunette on vacation from the Sorbonne, I'm not interested. Whatever it is you want from me, darling, I promise you won't get it. Are you well? Soldering on damn the misery. My wife is gonna right leave me for a man she fed at the dock. The bill is on fire? Goodness gracious. I'm not sure what they, they think they'll prove. Would you toddle off now? The smell of dung is rather overpowering.